just 15 minutes from Quebec City, is an incredible natural feature, a stunning waterfall called Montmorency. It offers a spectacular backdrop to the beginning of a new journey, the first time an Australian film crew has travelled this track. The train La Massif provides passage through some of this country's most beautiful scenery. The journey takes us through the region of Charlevoix, set in the spectacular Laurentian Mountains. It's incredible to think that 12 months ago we couldn't make this journey. Uh, you know, I mean, the Charlevoix region where we're heading to is quite isolated and you needed to build a train and there's one person with a bit of vision to build a train to take us there. It's part of the whole big picture. The train to Charlevoix was developed to open the region's delights up to a new tourism audience, thanks to Daniel Gautier, co-founder of Cirque du Soleil. Daniel grew up in this area, and this was his way of supporting the region's population. He boosted the whole region. These rail cars were originally built in 1952 and used in Chicago, before being purchased and having undergone a massive radical redesign and transformation, turning what were once two-level suburban boxcars into open, airy and highly sophisticated carriages, providing exceptional vistas for the passing scenery. Daniel's investment was made to provide travellers a Michelin star food experience on the journey to visit Quebec's food bowl. The train's destination is Daniel Gautier's new project, Hotel Le Ferme, in the town of Bay St. Paul. There would be few hotels in the world where their own train stops out the front of the lobby, making getting there simple. Hotel Le Ferme is one of the biggest employers now and offers visitors 145 rooms with differing levels of accommodation to suit your budget. From well-appointed suites of varying decor and themes to funky, extremely affordable dormitories, sleeping four. These are ideal for families or those heading to the Le Massif winter ski fields who intend on spending 90% of their time out of the hotel. The challenging ski slopes of La Massif are a major attraction within Canada and the USA, but surprisingly there's few people internationally who know just how good this place is for skiing. The mountain resort was purchased and restored by Daniel Gautier, an area he knew well from his youth and was the foundation of the La Massif de Chalavois project. Settled by the French before the Napoleonic Wars, the area has retained a passion for traditional, seasonally focused artisan foods. The weekly farmer's market is now held on the hotel grounds alongside the train station, providing the perfect venue to taste and talk to the farmer and buy organically grown cuisine that is simply sublime. It's said the farmers here produce food that's more French than France. Being isolated from the dramatic political and social changes, they produce and farm food much in the way the French would have experienced 400 years ago. The head chef from Hotel La Ferme supports local farmers by buying their produce as it's in season and then bringing it to the hotel's daily menu in their world-class restaurant. From a tourist point of view, this makes the region an absolute culinary delight to experience. A great way to see this beautiful region is by taking a motorbike sidecar tour, which can be organised by the hotel for you. This is home to some of the country's most spectacular scenery. The landscape was created by a meteor strike 350 million years ago and the elevated viewing platforms allow a chance to admire the mighty St Lawrence. Renown is the birthplace of Cirque du Soleil. A walk through the town of Bay St Paul reveals where Daniel Gauntier's creative background came from. The whole town has wonderful artistic underpinnings. 
Art galleries and craft shops abound in almost every street and present the perfect opportunity to buy a gift or a treasured memory of this region.